Yeah, Anita, Tom, we just found out from Norfolk Police, I just spoke with them, that both officers, or both sets of officers in both incidents that Bryant Stith claims happened were wearing body cameras and they are reviewing the video. We've asked if we can see the video as well. We're waiting for a response. But out here on Ocean View Avenue, this is where Bryant Stith claims twice he was walking down the street and twice he had terrible encounters, he says, with Norfolk Police. In late March, Bryant Stith walked along Ocean View Avenue while he says Norfolk police looked for suspects in a car theft. And then they just stopped me. They were just like, hey, come here. Stith knew not to run. Okay, if I tried to run, they would arrest me. You know, that's not that's not smart. But he didn't expect what he claims happened next. The other police officer grabbed my other arm and stuff, and so they tried to push me against the car. So they put my they put my chest on the car hood and stuff, so they tried to push my head down. Stith claims two Norfolk police officers used excessive force on him that morning and slammed him onto the pavement, chipping his tooth. He even went down to the station and filed a complaint. I talked to Sergeant Perry, and he just he interviewed me on you know, what happened March 22nd, and, then was just, and he just told me that something was going to happen to the police officers, but he can't tell me exactly what's going to happen to them. Then a week later, he claims it happened again, this time as he walked outside of a 7-Eleven. He says two officers asked for his ID, and he refused, and this time he resisted them putting their hands on him. He just grabbed me, then like they just like they put me on the cop car, and then they put the handcuffs on me, and then when they did it, they like kind of they kind of scratched my, my wrist up a little bit. After that encounter with police, officers charged him with resisting arrests and failure to produce his ID. How are you going to arrest me for resisting arrest? And you never told me where I was getting arrested for the first time. Norfolk police tell me they know about both incidents. They are reviewing both allegations by Stith as well as the body camera video. Now coming up at 6 o'clock, we'll have more from Norfolk police and what they say they're doing to make sure everything was done correctly. We we'll want more from Stith on what he says happened on both of those occasions. That's at 6 o'clock on Wavy News 10 at 6. In Norfolk, Matt Gregory, 10 on your side.